Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Rosanna. So in today's video, we're just doing um, some new makeup reviews. So that is what we're going to be talking about today. But before we get into that video, I would love, love, love for you to subscribe to my channel. You could ring the bell. It would give you notifications of when I post, which is every Tuesday and every Saturday between one and two-ish. So yeah, like, make comments, ring the bell, tell your friends, subscribe, help a newbie out. I would so, so appreciate your support. And thank you so, so much for helping me grow this channel. And now without further ado, let's get started. Alrighty, cool. I um I don't know what's going on with my face today. My face feels I'm gonna just grab my mirror, which is right over here. It's awfully big. I'm gonna see if I yeah. But I'm just gonna put this light on. My face feels so dry today. I do have my um I do have on my foundation and my eyebrows. I just put on the um it your skin but better foundation and skincare. And again, it was so friggin' dry. So I just spritzed my face with the Rare Beauty. This is the Rare Beauty Always an Optimist um, setting spray just to put in more hydration in my face. So I don't know what the heck's going on. But um, yeah, so that's what we have on. So I wanted to review some new products. Again, girl, I don't think they're new, but they're new to me. I still have stuff that I picked up from the Ulta um, 21 Day of Beauty. So I really want to start reviewing them. Actually, I did do a Get Ready With Me last week with new products. I'll link that below. But um, I picked up so many, I figured. So first product I grabbed are these Nude Sticks Sticks. So these are, I think, eyeshadows. Hold on, let's see here. These are, yeah, these are eye colors. So I picked up three of them. One, two, three. One, two, three. So let's open up these little lovers. Really cute. I like this little packaging because, you know, I'm like a packagey kind of girl. I will save this for like, I don't know. You could put your Q-tips in here, girl. You could put um, um, your bobby pins. You know, I, I, I like these little boxes. I'm a bag order. Ooh, look how cute it comes in. I also love paper. You know I love paper. So this comes with this beautiful paper. Oh, cute. Let's see. Comes with these two little lovers right over here. No idea. Let's see here. What is this dog on it? This is an uber long wearing eyeshadow pencil that highlights, provides intense color, precise lining, and primes lids for all day wear. A soft and super gliding um, easy to blend eye color with even payoff that is waterproof, long wearing, ideal for oily lids. These fun and sassy touch and go makeup sticks because you know I love that stuff. I love anything quick and on the go. Um, makeup sticks provide a quick and easy uh, nude look but better for all faces and all places. Let's check it out. So what the heck is this though? Oh, it's a sharpener. I love it. This one I picked up in Queen Olive. I am really, I have been really loving like that grungy, I, I want to say like dirty green, but you know what I'm talking about, like that army fatigue or what these kids now say, uh, girl, it's taken me forever to get this out. Or like that camouflage green kind of look. It smells like nothing. Ooh, that's beautiful. Wow. Ooh, they are so friggin' creamy. Let's just hope they really legitimately stay. Look how beautiful that is. Exactly what I was thinking. So lovely. And I just opened these ahead of time, girl, because we're going to be here forever. So same thing with the um, pencil sharpener. That's so, so great. I love that. And, um, so, and then this one I got in Spirit. These are beautiful. Wow. That is so friggin' pretty. So this is in Spirit. And then last but not least, I got this one in taupe. Girl, I am a taupey girl. I'm a cool kind of girl. I love uh, that taupey. Yeah, it looks so pretty. I love like that taupe. Yeah, it's so beautiful. Look how beautiful. And I believe this one does not have any kind of shimmer in it, right? I don't think so. Of course, they have to mold the lawn today. But girl, I got things to do today. We're going to have some background music because, um, yeah, this is so, so beautiful. So I definitely want to play with these. But, 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 I did pick up this, um, the Kaja Beauty Bento. This is the Soft Matte Eyeshadow Trio. I have um, one of their trio faces, and I also have another trio eyeshadow. This one is in Velvet Dreams. I think I have, like, Chocolate Dahlia or something like that. So, so nice. Again, I'm a compacty kind of girl. Throw it in your little pocketbook, girl. Go buying good luck for the weekend. I love that. So let's just take a look at this. Ooh, this is so beautiful. So it's just a nice cream colored. I like a, a light 
color in my palettes because I love to put it underneath my eyebrows. I don't like any shimmers underneath my brows. And then the middle one, oh, I think this may be a whole matte thing, right? Did I just say it was a matte? Soft matte eyeshadow? Yes, yeah, girl, you're smart. See, when it says soft matte, I'm assuming that they're all mattes. Smarty pants. So this is the middle color right over here. And then the last color, yes, sorry, Bob. That is so, so pretty. Let's watch these three. I'm going to just start from the bottoms. Oh, they are so friggin' buttery. That is so nice. I'm going to just put it right next to it. Now, this last color over here, you know, it's just not my cup of tea. I don't like those burnt orangey kind of colors. Oh, these are so buttery. But, 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 I have been, you, I have been wearing more um, warmer colors now that it's fall. Oh, these are so buttery and beautiful. Look how nice. As I'm looking down, it just dawned on me. This little gadget right over here. Hello. Hi there. It's a mirror. Oh my God. That is so fantastic. Okay. I'm definitely, definitely going to keep them. Okay. And then with that, girl, I completely forgot I bought the Gucci blush. Duh. I had it in like another bin because I have bins right here to try out. I had it in another bin and of course I completely forgot about it. I did pick this up from the website. It comes with this beautiful pouch. You know, girl, I'm a sucker for packaging. And it came with a bigger pouch. So, so beautiful. So I'm just, I don't even remember which one I bought. I picked it up such a while ago. As soon as they came out, ugh. But here's the packaging right over here. It's got like just this plastic covering on it. Bachi, I know you're staring at me. This friggin' dog is like, um, I don't want to look, but he's like right there. Again, I don't know why I have to be controlled by you. So I know if I look at him, he's going to say, girl, you know, we have to go for a walk. Oh my God, I can't even say the W word. Don't say it out loud. Okay, so here it is. So, so cute. But damn it, girl. It's a freaking packaging. Why? Why you gotta, why you gotta do me like that, Gucci? Mm -hmm. Hell no. Why you gotta do me like that? I have the bronzer and the blush. I mean, the bronzer and the powder. It's enormous. So I'm going to just pop this open. It's pretty. Okay, it's got like that hint of that, you know, that florally. I can't stand smelling any of my products, but that floral throws me right over the edge. I did pick up the one in Radiant Pink. Radiant um, pink. What a shocker. I'm going to just, ooh, I don't want to mess up the emblem. I'm going to just grab it right from under here. Ooh, it's so buttery. Ooh, it's so pretty. Okay, this smells horrendous, but you know how I feel about that. But it's so pretty. Wow, that's gorgeous. Oh, isn't that so nice? So we're definitely going to play with that. And then, what the heck is this one? I picked up this Kaja. What did I pick up, girl? Oh, this is the Moisturizing Melt Lip Gloss in... What did I get it in? This was in Be Mine. This is a gloss. Mm. So let's try this on, shall we? Why? Look how cute that thing is. It's like a heart. It is so adorable. So I'm going to just... Pump it up like this. Put it right over here. Oh, it's really pretty. That's 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 not a gloss. That's some lip smack and stick rooney. Now that I have a little mirror here, let's try it. Okay. If you just want to just tap it on. Uh 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 uh. No, sir. Tap it on lightly. It is pretty. It's pretty. All right. So we'll just leave that on there. Not really my color. I don't know why would I pick this. I guess because I thought it was like a full-on gloss gloss. And you know, I like this kind of a tint in a gloss. But this is very opaque. Well, more opaque than I would like in a gloss. Speaking of glosses, I did also pick up these Too Faced Hangover Pillow Balms. So I picked this one up in... I'm going to open these little lovers. I picked up three. Ooh, this is so pretty. This one is in... Um, let's make it up. This was in the clear... Is there an, are there names on these bad boys? This one's in the clear. I don't know. And then I got, this is Watermelon Kiss. Ooh, now this is what I thought the Kaja was like. That's Watermelon Kiss. And then I picked up, what is that, Watermelon Kiss? Watermelon Kiss, and I picked up Mango Kiss. Oh my gosh, that is so friggin' pretty. Isn't that so nice? So I picked that up. And then I also picked up a NARS. See, I'm getting into the coral. Because you know I don't like coral. But every time I say that, it looks good. I'm going to take this off. Bachi, I swear that all this good is glorf. Because he sees all these boxes and you want to chew it on me. He's going to run with them. So this is the NARS. 
Oh, I like it. It's 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 more of like an orangey. Hush it now. Hush it now. Hush it. Don't you dare. Don't you dare. No. Hush it now. This is more of like an, a peachy. Um, ooh. Okay, so this is what I thought like the kaja would look like. It's kind of like that. I know I'm like this. Like that glossy kind of look. Um, Cause yeah, that's not gonna work for me. That's just not. And P.S. I'm wiping all the makeup off, and um, these three nude sticks is not coming off at all. And then last but not least, with the new one is I picked up this um, the NYX the NYX Professional Lip Pencil in pale pink out of curiosity. So let's just check that out. And that's pretty. It's, it's more of like a mauve pink right up my alley, right up my alley. Restless stuff, not new. Anyway, let's get to the application, shall we? Let me just pull my hair do back. Okay, so if you hear anything crunching. He grabbed one of the boxes. Anyway, let's get down to business, shall we? And so I'm gonna go in with the Kaja, and let's see, I'm gonna put this color over here, all over my eyelid. This is great. Okay, so this is very, very pretty. I love when a palette has like a nice light color because I like to use that as a base. And then I'm going to go in with the next color over here. And I kind of, this is going to go, this is going to work out really well because the other one, the other colors from Nude Stick, I think two of them are shimmers. So that would be perfect because I really, really wanted to incorporate both of these. Very beautiful. I love the Kaja um, formula. It is as small and cute and compact as they are. Their formula is so daggone buttery and delicious. And I like that they're not really um, that pigmented. So it gives you room to work. You know, I know that people are like, oh my God, it's so pigmented. This is great, this and that. But people that are uncomfortable or people that are new or people that really don't know how that is so intimidating so i could really appreciate when colors are buildable that is super de duper nice perfect 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 i'm gonna go in with a smaller brush now i think i'm gonna take um the a the a502 and i'm gonna go into the darker color i'm gonna just put this for placement so i think i'm gonna just stop talking right now we may speed it up because there's so many other products that I want to try. really pretty I really really love these sticks it gives you just enough time to work with them but you got to work fast I really love that that is so so nice I just wish there was one darker color I just wanted to deepen up the edges well, you know what I think I'm gonna just use the tote again I just want to deepen up the edges just a little bit over here because I do have hooded eyes so And then I'm going to take the, um, the original color, Where Are You? Yep. And I just want to soften that up just a little bit. Just like right here. Okay, these don't budge, so work fast, sister. Okay, that is really, really nice. I'm really, really enjoying that. All right, cool. So, let's see here. Um... I'm going to just do the rest of my face. Like I'm going to do a little bit of contouring with the Charlotte Tilbury. I have my uh, Charlotte Tilbury under eye, uh, beautiful skin concealer. So let me just step off that because I don't think I have anything new for that. I do have the blush. We're gonna def definitely going to do the blush. So, um, so let me just step off. Let me just do uh, that, mascara, all that good stuff because none of that is new. Of course, I will have everything linked below. And then we'll be back to do the blush. What am I missing? The blush and the lips. I'll be right back. Okay, the eyes came out beautiful. I did use the taupe and the Queen Olive underneath my eyes. I'm just going to come closer. I put the um, the taupe 
in the waterline and then I put the olive underneath so so pretty okay cool so let's get to the blush shall we so this is the Gucci blush is in radiant pink I'm like so excited this packaging is outstandingly beautiful and delicious okay so I want to get like a special brush they're all, all the same they're all the same I am going to get my refer number four brush I love these angled brushes for blush I'm going to just tap it in so pretty Ooh, look at that so I'm going to just tap a little bit because I don't know how pigmented these are yeah pretty pigmented oh that is so beautiful oh that is so nice okay I will tell you that the smell isn't as potent as their other products that is so pretty wow that's beautiful 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 now I will tell you this girl is it extraordinary no but it's the Gucci you know I'm a sucker for packaging and the packaging is so cute so I am going to go on the apples of the cheek this looks so pretty oh I am in love love um, with these nude sticks eyeshadows I wish I would have gotten more but I will tell you be careful because these the taupe up here I wanted to try and blend them out a little bit and a uh, girl they're stuck so be careful I would use I would do one eye at a time so I would recommend that this is absolutely gorgeous okay let's go in now with the with the lip smack I'm gonna tell you right now this is a no for me I'm just I, I, I thought it was more of a glossy with the tint in the background but mm, that's gonna be a no oh, let me just put some highlighter on real quick I just grabbed the my Dior this is um, the 001 universe universe universal universal so let me just throw um, some highlighter on look how gorgeous that is so beautiful okay but this is not a new product so beautiful okay good so we did that so let's go in with the lip liner if I was the liner Ooh, oh here it is right up my alley and of course girl this is not new but it's certainly new to me so let me just line my lips this is very pink I will tell you this video and the previous video like nothing friggin matched but you know at first I'm thinking girl you could have done a better job like matching things together but you know what that's the whole point of these videos is to review the product I mean I didn't want to like plan it like I just wanted it to be like organic so a lot of the stuff doesn't match but like I said we're doing the review okay this lip liner is beautiful I love that I mean maybe not for the fall but perfect for summer I also just picked up natural which I am loving that would have been good for this but anyway so let's just put the gloss on this is the hangover um, the Too Faced hangover pillow balm so let's just try this one I'm sure it's gonna be you know just like your lips but a beautiful gloss mmm these smell nice I like this doe foot, it's very spongy. So yep. Mmm. Mmm. That feels amazing. Wow. This is beautiful. Okay, this is deceitful. This looks like nothing, but look how could it be like the lip liner? I don't think so. Mmm. That is beautiful. Wow, that is so so nice. Okay, let me take it off. If I were my wipe where the heck did I put my wipe mmm that's nice okay a little bit of the um, lip liner is still remaining and this one is in watermelon mmm and my mouth water it smells like watermelon that's nice ooh guys beautiful this is this feels more like a doggone moisturizer it's almost like Mm, that smells so damn good I want to eat it don't do that kids don't eat it this feels like I mean it's a balm but it feels like mmm it's so beautiful it feels like one of like a solid balm but this one is in like a liquid form it feels like a lotion oh that is so friggin pretty damn that is so nice and then last but not least but I still have to check out the NARS too I think we're gonna go back to this only because it kind of matches like the eyeshadow but let's look so I'm gonna go in this is the mango 
the watermelon is my favorite smell. I'm going to see if I could come close when I do this. So if you could see, it's so lotion-y. That's beautiful. Okay, that's the mango. Actually, the mango looks clearer than the clear. But it is pretty, though. Everything's beautiful. Okay, then last but not least, I really, really want to try this NARS. God, I love that packaging. That is spectacular. Love it. Let's try the NARS. And this is the NARS Afterglow. God, if they can make this any smaller. The Afterglow. I'm going to make it up. The Afterglow um, in Torrid. This looks so beautiful. Yep, get a delivery. No, come right now. Interrupt everything. First mow the lawn, then deliver. Go ahead. Ooh. Okay. This is beautiful. I love NARS. This is so beautiful. Don't mind all the fucking noise in the background. <sighs> this is gorgeous. Now, this is like, this is a thinner, mm, this is a thinner feeling balm than this. Where this feels like a traditional, mmm, like balm. So, so good. Okay, so I think that is it. Let me just do like a quick recap. Hello? I am like so freaking impressed with these um, eyeshadow sticks. Of course, these were, you know, 50% off when the um, the 21 Day of Beauty was there. But girl, I got to tell you, next time they're on sale, I'm going to have to pick up more. They are beautiful. Very, very impressed. This, I mean, I knew Kaja. They are so, so great. Buttery and creamy and delicious. Girl, I will tell you, I mean, this blush is nothing special. It's a blush. It is beautiful. It is buttery. I might have a million kind of formulas like this, but girl, if you want to splurge, do it. It's Gucci. It's beautiful. The packaging is beautiful. I got to tell you, it doesn't smell as bad as the other ones. And you know what I'm talking about. You know what I'm talking about. This is beautiful, beautiful. And I will tell you this, I'm like super, super impressed with these lip balms. They are gorgeous. And this is beautiful. I'm going to have to keep this in my bag. Ooh, that is so, so nice. And finally, um, this lip liner. I think NYX probably has one of the best drugstore lip liners. In my opinion, they are so, so nice. So I think that's it, guys. Of course, everything I have on will be linked below. You know that. And um, yeah, so this is my video reviewing new makeup. I hope you enjoyed it. Thank you so, so much for sharing your time with me. And as always, you guys, be good to each other, love each other, and have a great, great day. Bye.